Hello everyone and welcome to chapter 12 of our saga. Last time we basically spent some time sitting around waiting for an initial attack from the Monte Cudro in our first war since heading out into the galaxy. We haven't seen anything yet so we're speculating that the Keterods have them engaged and are keeping them distracted for the moment. We finally design our resupply ships but hold off on installing any death rays due to not only the massive cost but the ship space needed to install them. We still need a little bit more tech before it's a viable option. And we're quickly finding out that race wars aren't the only danger in the galaxy as many space creatures started impeding our ability to build more resort bases. Join us now as we continue to plummet our cash flow into the red. Retrofits. Out of there. Okay. Well, I figures there's a pirate in there. I guess I got to get a force up there to deal with that. Ooh, diutes. Very aggressive. And since we got a bit more money. Uh, should add a few more drop ships. We got many ships are in that fleet actually. We have twelve, so we've upgraded to four each, which will be forty-eight hundred. Forty-seven. One more to go here. Forty-eight. There we go. So forty-eight hundred. That's forty-eight troops. I don't know what kind of firepower that's going to work into. Yeah, OG is under attack. OG, big surprise. All right, we got construction ships done again. So, um, Wonder if I should pick out a more resorts or maybe we'd better look at some uh strategics here. Um let's just see what's close by here. Ooh, more fuel. That's probably a good idea. Sure. Ooh, that's a big planet. Build a fuel extractor. Speaking of which, those two get done. They did. Now these have to go back to two gas extractors. Unfortunately, I messed those two up. So you need to be just gas extractors. Okay, so I'm going to retrofit those, and I'll just take my little tick out of there to show that I've done that now. Right. And one more constructor. Let's see what else we got up. That's close by. Turn on luxuries a bit. I kind of forget where we are on that stuff. Looks like we're going to pick one up there. Oh no, that's going to be a resort location. Well, we might as well put a miner on it as well. Just an orbital miner will be fine. Nope. Luxury extractor, luxury miner. There we go. Pretty sure we got somebody going there. Resort base, yeah. So if somebody's on its way to do it. We have Paratus in the game. Ooh, look at their GDP. They're doing quite well, and they have Loris Fruit, which they refuse to trade with us. 
cheap bastards. Trade it. Trade it now. Give me old stuff. And we got resupply ships coming off the line now. Is that our first one? Nope, we got two, so I'm going to select that one. Okay, let's get you. Is there fuel in our home system on this one? No, there isn't. No, it's over here. So I'm going to get you to deploy here. And then the next one. Uh, get them both to deploy here. That'll just fill up their tanks and we can take them off and go to do what we need to do. And that's something I just realized too. I'm going to want a bunch of construction ships here shortly. Probably before that gets done. I'm going to grab four. We'll get them built like as soon as possible here. What have I been doing here? Oh, these bars are really messing me up. How come I can't move? All right, these work different in this screen. There's no move to top. All right, there we go. So I'll get some more construction ships. Um, where is that little fleet that I had here? You. I'm going to send you for retrofit. And I'm going to unbase you from there. I don't know why we're up here, but Seems we're doing okay. Oh, why are we up here? Do I have rogue uh, frigates kicking around? Oh, I must have forgot to put something in fleets. Uh, that's fine, I guess, but I'd rather these guys not all over the place. That's probably the last build I did. I didn't put them into fleets. Yeah, none of these are in fleets. You need to be in Zuma reserves. Okay, that's fine. Okay, finish what you're doing. Oh, looks like we're boarding it. Oh, that's fine. We got another independent colony discovered, Obgintus. With only a few troops on the ground. Where's this? And a rune. That's way over there. Interesting. That's a long way out, though. Kind of committed to this one. The other one we could definitely do. We could definitely do that one with the troops we have. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure on that. And we. Can... No hyperdrive. Lovely. what they're running on these days. They got Maxis Blasters, Tractor Beams, Senior Shields, 100 Armor. They have damage control, but no repair. And I'm not sure what you're going to do. Oh, yeah, yeah, Hyper Drive. 
been just disabled at the time. Okay. Uh, let me go repair over here. Second thought. Just retire at your shipyard. See if we can get some tech bonuses out of that. Yeah, territory map swap, sure. Just accept those. Not much kicking up from this. It would be a little more intense than this. I haven't seen anything yet. Traders Bazaar. Oh, you bastards. Uh, my beautiful wonder they've started it and I'm not even close to even teching it yet. Well, I guess we're not getting that this game. Wow, we're getting on. We're not getting a lot of stuff in this game. <laughs> I was counting on like abandoned ships and debris fields close by. I'm not getting any of that. Okay, they're still deploying. I think. What happened? Select, go to. Oh, deployed, okay. No, you're deployed. I was looking at the no mission. Uh-oh. That's not a good sign. Keteros are losing territory to these guys. So they're obviously not coming after me. They're going after the Keterovs. Oh, Keterovs took one off them. Uh-oh. Oh, fired. Okay. Ooh. Excellent. No carriers, but we got the fighters. I would love missile, missiles. Could come out one more on that. Could come out one more on that. But man, missiles. I miss my missiles. I just don't know if they have enough time to actually tech those up enough. We do have a range increase to 550 here. We fire at 2.9. 2.6. 2.7. Well, this is an improvement. We'll get the immediate effect from it. I'm just going to keep coming out here. I'd like to get into this stuff like real quick. Those would have been handy for that invasion. Oh, I didn't even think of that. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll go with that for now. Say goodnight, Daisy. <laughs> oh, oh, here we go. Uh, towards Kappa Canyon Encounter. Ooh. 
Oh, it's still got the big weapon on it. Looks like it just fired too. And missed. <laughs> I'm not going to survive this, but nice shot. Yeah, I could have used about six more of those weapons on that station, but oh well. Uh, what am I missing here? Construction ship under attack. Oh, and we succeeded. Territory map. Marshy Swamp. Ooh, good. We got Marshy Swamp now. Well, I was going to come out here, but there's not much point rate. Although it does improve trade bonuses. I think that might still be worth coming out for then. Let's pick this one up anyways. And yeah, we can get going on... Uh, Marshy Swamps now. Let's just see what the expansion plan Oops. shows us now for colonizable planets. Quite a few now. See one continental in the 90s. An 89 and a 25. The rest are just too far away. It didn't really open up a whole lot. A few more options, but nothing of great value. Some average stuff. Okay. Maybe a little bit helps, I guess. So the Keterovs took one, and it looks like they took one. Ooh, Natural Harmony. Zuma Prime. Another 1% natural quality gain. 94% now. Excellent. That should help our bottom line a little bit. It looks like they got a fleet in here. Nope, I took it back. Nope. Yeah, my color blindness again. And you're already suggesting new missions. Uh, who do we just meet? These guys. Better spies by 50%. I guess we won't bother with them. And there's somebody else who just came along. Who was that? I have no idea now. Oh, Diutes. Yes, the Diutes. Do we know where the Diutes are? Doesn't look like it. So go for the Diute Empire. We'll see what we can figure out there. Give you a bit more experience. Diute. All right, let's see what happens now. Yeah, I like that weapon, except we could have used like six more on that station to be effective at all. Not exactly sure how to use it now. And construction ships, yes, how are we doing with those? Oh yes, we got a bunch of new ones built now. Uh, speaking of which, we probably got all the resupply ships, not quite yet. Oh, that's right, I put the construction ships ahead of these, so. But I think that's a new one. And we'll take you in here just to get your tanks filled up. Deploy there, it'll be fine. Kelter again. Uh, Sanctuary of Vulcan Junction. Investigate. 
Starting off weak in an L5. Oh. Every one of these I've gone to has had a creature beside it. And of course, I got two construction ships coming in here, too. And we do have a guardian right there. Uh, let me just change this quickly. Okay, he's running as well. Gotta love those repair bots. And we're being attacked like no tomorrow here in a new empire. Uh, hang on. Pirate frigate. Sand slugs. Okay, it's fine. Okay, you can be re-automated. Off you go. And hopefully those two guys are going to come back in. Yep. Cut her off fleet, I think. Yep. Hmm. Not sure what's going on with these guys. I haven't seen anything in our area from them. Count our blessings, I guess. Money, money, money. Speaking of money. Ah, bonus and gravitic weapons. Ooh, all of it. Okay. I'll take it. Your have imposed trade sanctions. Securians have given us 391 credits. Bought us lunch. Thanks. So these guys are getting kind of pissy with us, are we? Okay, fine, fine. Angry. Don't like our style of government. Hey, flag stealer. <laughs> That's our flag. What you doing? Okay, so these supply ships should be pretty much filled up. And we should be able to go do something with them anyway. I think that... What do we put on there? Uh, let's look at the design here. 6,500. I'm not sure what they're going to fill to. I guess they're still filling up. Well, I guess they don't have to be full. This one's pretty full. And what's your range? Let's look at like that. Now, thing is, I don't know if there's fuel in here. But we'll bring him up to sort of figure that out. If it's not in there, then it might be one of these surrounding systems. We'll have to find it. Make sure we have a refuel option when we get there. And there's another beacon here. Are there any explorers in that area? One right there refueling. Ugh. No, refuel. Hit the control key. Thank you. Then move there. It's going to go there, though. 
And I'll go control zero to bookmark that ship. And hopefully I remember. Critical breakthrough for advanced torpedoes. Excellent. Pirate stuff everywhere. homeworld looking these days. Ooh, 3%. Look at us go. Well, I guess I better think about this. Uh, so 48 troops. Now I do have this fleet here too. I could throw in there. Actually, I should upgrade you. Pretty sure you're still... Mark two, yeah. I think we're on Mark three on those. Oh, on the uh, yeah, the military stuff. Uh, we got wars going on here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't remember half the names of the uh, races. Diutes, okay. Let's have a quick look. Well, we're moving up. Ooh, lose the fewest ships and bases has gone up to 33% now. So if we can make a few more free trade agreements, stay out of the war as much as possible, and control some more continental colonies, we might be able to pull it. What year is it? Okay, we're 11 years into the game now. So another 20 years before the victories actually kick in. We do have a chance of actually maybe doing something here. Yeah, if everybody else keeps fighting and losing ships, then uh, to lose the fewest ships and bases in the galaxy might uh, might be a thing we can achieve. Anybody else pretty friendly with us? These guys are pleased, but in my experience, they don't really respond well to uh, trade agreements, but we'll try again. Cannot accept. Yeah, I just don't know whether they. Ex what are their? Uh, what do they work towards here? Have the fewest treaties in the galaxy. That's why they don't respond well to them. Yeah. So chances are we're not going to be able to do anything with them. It's not part of the victories. Um, who else is kind of pleased? Oh, we're spying against them. Or no, we spied against them and figured out where they are. They're over here. Plus 10. I doubt they're going to go for it. Um, a bit of money, maybe? Okay, well, that's better anyway. Xenox. Too hasty to enter now, we feel. Okay. 
Get a bit of money. No. Uh, we got the Hakanish, the Wekaris. All right, well, they're not uh, ticking off any of our partners too much, so maybe we'll try them. No. No. But you might be back. Uh, these guys are pleased, too. Yippee! We accept! Cool. Okay, well, we'll let the other guys stew, but that should uh, bring us up to 83%. All right, there we go. That continental planet stuff is going to be our Achilles heel, I think. I don't know whether I'm going to find enough to actually get us to 100%. Ooh. Pirate cruiser. Two hundred ten firepower. Okay, I got two of my escorts after it. Hmm. That's probably not gonna work out very well. That's pretty close to home too. I'll bring this little fleet down, see if we can't do a capture on this. Yeah, he's going to run. Yep. Alright, uh, I guess you're not doing that now. Uh, you can probably follow him. Uh, now you can do it with individual ships. Well, we'll just get you to follow him. Oh, Xenox have offered mining rights within their territory. Giving us money. More mining rights, okay. And a free trade, all right. And we found the stone city of Vendelian. Investigate those. And nothing of interest, okay. Free trade, yes please. All right, Does that help us. Oh, look at us move. 95%, I need one more. Put us to 100%. And lose ships and base. Oops. Lose few ships and bases now up to 50%. Man, it ticks me off. I got another 20 years to freaking hold this <laughs> before the victories kick in. Okay. So if I would have went with the standard 20-year victory, nobody would have got it yet. These guys would be pretty close, but they need to subjugate the most empires in the galaxy. Yeah, fourth place. I'm kind of happy to see that. Uh, I almost need to see about getting out of this war, though. New Fleet Admiral. Ooh, mining rights again. Okay, we got a new casino. And a mining station done, I guess. Alright. Boarding. 528. And a new leader elected. 
Kupi Aksari is now our new leader. I don't see the kind of monstrosity he brings to my freaking empire here. Yeah, a couple knit, a couple of reds here, but the rest of it's not bad. Happiness. Counter espionage plus eight. Beautiful. Coney income plus four. And diplomacy minus six, but it's on a scalable trait, so hopefully that'll go away here shortly. I hope that's not going to mess us up too much. Looks like people are still pleased. Okay. Um, so I got to put these guys back to work. Looks like we got a couple that are ready to go. There's a rune in there too, which I can probably build on right now. I don't know which one of those is the ones we want, but we'll just do this. Uh, space hotel. Thank you. What else was on that? Silicon. Put a Lux Miner on that as well. If we're building one thing, we might as well build another. We can help protect each other. A little close to that border, but I think we're fine. Okay, and we got another rune in here. Oop. Uh, hang on. I can't build anything here. Must be some must be a one on there already. We got that one. I think we just got that one. Oh, you're running out of there for some reason. No, we didn't get to build it. Slugs and pirates. Oh, not so conish. Hmm. And with that, we bring Chapter 12 to a close. We experienced our first loss in the war with the Montecudro as a resort base got destroyed, but not before we got to see our death ray in action. We really need the money and tech to install a bunch of those. Things have heated up between the Keterovs and the Montecudro as they have lost systems to each other. And between low ship losses and a couple more free trade agreements, we appear to be inching our way up the victory ladder. We still have 20 years before the victory conditions kick in, so anything can still happen. So join us next time as we continue on. Thanks for watching.